Okay, R6004 back with part 5 of the Let's Play. Basically, uh, now we're doing Air Chase. Uh, sorry that I haven't released a Let's Play for like two and a half months or something. I've been extremely busy. But these next weeks... I plan to release Let's Plays left and I right. You are I have for some all the video action, recorded, actually, we've got plenty but I just here. have to, like, we are taking add the to audio. The air for this scene. I want you to chase the bad guy in his plane and bring him down with your propeller. Sounds like propaganda, because he's like, it's chase the bad guy. Everything has bad guy. It's like one of those cheap movies. Where there's a clear defined bad guy, clear good guy, boring, completely unintense plot, but this game isn't really a plot game. So yeah, you just have to like break down his plane using your propeller, which usually is kind of like impossible, but because it's a Lego, it's fun. So basically, you just have to collect these power-ups, but it's extremely easy. As you can see, I'm probably not as conservative as, like, the Tea Party. I kind of, like, use my gas when I get it. But you don't really have to put some strategy in in bronze level, at least. How he can fly with one wing. Me out. Look at that. He's just flying with one wing. Even though he's in, he's emitting a lot of smoke exhaust. I don't know how that has correlation, but basically he was on this like flying platform with one stick and it uh jutting out of it and he was able to float. Whatever. Too late, he's dead. I don't get the arcade feature of this. I mean, not many people will actually use this leaderboard thing, in my opinion. I don't get it, but it's there. So yeah, once again, I help. I find myself wishing that I actually got some real money instead of these useless trophies. Crazy stunt man. I guess I have no choice. But I'm not pleased. See, did that ever happen? First of all, you, you can clearly see that the time of day is completely off from the actual filming. Quote unquote filming. So, yeah, now off to silver, which is not actually that hard. It's just basically the same method. I hope you are ready for some more action. See, it's weird because Cause we've got he has this monotone for like the first few we words, and then suddenly the he takes this like weird pitch, I want you and then he goes the down, in his then he goes back and up, bring him down with your and then he's in monotone, and then he just says like propeller with this weird sound. So yeah, I'll just collect fuel. Ram down. And then he just looks back. He's kind of stupid because why would he look back? I mean, if you were to look back, wouldn't you, ha wouldn't you be at risk for like falling debris and stuff? Well, obviously, Brickster doesn't care, or the director wants him to die, so. Yeah. 
The director, unfortunately, has all the authority here. Well, at least he should. But unfortunately, he sets up these dangerous stunts which he doesn't even choreograph. So he forces Pepper to star. And all you get from doing all this like literally dangerous, dangerous stuff is a trophy that you're never gonna use ever again. So yeah, that really puts these modern day actors into perspective. lost his propeller again. I mean his wing. I bet the producers of this didn't even take physics class. They flunked out. Another trophy. It's useless. <laughs> I'm surprised you're still in one piece. See, he even admits it. He sets the Pepper up for these like awkward, dangerous stunts. And then all he does is produce these awkward rushes that have little correlation with the actual quote unquote filming. See that rush was actually kind of this it's like the only one that's ever been sort of accurate, but it's not even accurate because of time of day. The producers of this game fail me once again. I hope you are ready for some more action, because we've got plenty for you here. We are taking what a surprise. Scene. I want you to Isn't that kind of obvious given the title bring name? Him down I don't know. Propeller. Director's kind of stupid, but as I said earlier, he has full control of this, so. There wouldn't be much that I could do. So, yeah, in gold, it just gets retarded because these. Uh, these tanks of fuel, they're just like flying around as this pepper can use the force, which I already knew. So, yeah, I'm not exactly the conservative with my fuel, but. I do get the job done. Pipsqueak, huh? I bet Brickster Rick himself is a pipsqueak when he's crying when he's lost. Sorry about that. It's just as I record with fraps, basically the two videos. Uh, they uh, it records in separate videos, so yeah, that was the transition between two videos. Because there's no like cockpit. 
Well, it's open. There's no barrier, so. Would the air pressure be too much for them to withstand? See, now I even hate the director more because he's forcing these actors to go through an intense air pressure while trying to crash each other. And that's kind of like fail directing. It's, there are too many variables, so terrible directing if this was in real life well it, could, it, it can't be nobody would ever agree to this that was amazing stuff. <laughs> i'm surprised you're still in one piece yeah i like that comic crazy stuff man take a look at the rushes i'm sure well, once again i'm not Since when did that happen? Helicopters flying right under the airplane? Seriously. Alright, so that concludes uh, part 5 of the Let's Play. Stay frosty, I will come at you with part 6, hopefully really soon. But in the meantime, I might release part 1 of my next Let's Play which probably will feature Battlefront 